so it's been about two years since we purchased this only fire charcoal basket from Amazon and I wanted to go ahead and talk to you guys about how it's held up over the past two years it's been two years exact right so normally something of metal right with a whole bunch of fire staying there for hours on end usually deteriorates over time but not this thing man this thing feels like it has some weight to it the bars the metal bars in here they have not lost any in the integrity normally you would see rust or whatever and then you can kind of like push through or it weaken up but not this thing man and if you guys checked out my Kamado videos you guys would see that I use this every single time I will also go ahead and link up a video of when I first purchased it I think it's right over here or right over here but anyways guys it did lose the chrome deal but it it's not losing its integrity one bit and I think one of the reasons why this might be for you is because of the same thing that I talked about in the first video and it's going to be because of this now on the Kamado style basket that basket has these handles right it sticks so far up and it has uh, these handles so that the whole dividing concrete can come up with it this one does not it's separate right on the other one you would just flip it a little bit to the side and pick up the entire basket that's a that's a very very good idea I like that especially because if you have a bunch of coals and you want to get the Kamado to go ahead and cool off a lot cool a lot quicker all you got to do is just go boom pick it up and get it out the way no problem in this one you can see right over here that it has about a half inch gap between this and the divide and conquer what does that mean it means that you can go ahead and put a plate and put one of these uh, heat deflectors in there you can actually put both of them in there you can put both of them right in there no problem and it's not going to get in in the way of the ash basket why is this important well because whenever you are trying to do a low and slow and use that basket what's going to happen is that if you use the Komodo version the Komodo Joe version you're not going to be able to go ahead and fit it j just as easy as I do right the divide and conquer has a 360 degree ring right over here that you can just put the plates however you want it boom if you want it this direction that direction whatever the case may be you can put it right in there with the Komodo basket it has these little rings on top that's where you're gonna have to balance them out right it's gonna have one here 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 and here and you're gonna have to balance them right not always ideal especially with a hot fire right over here right underneath so this just makes it use the divide and conquer just like from the factory without anything like that and it works really good like I said I've used this for such a long time no problems no issues it's held up great it's still solid man so just want to make a quick video about this man um, it's a very good basket it's a very good option that you can have it's withstood two years and for the price of it man you really can't go wrong I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description below so that you can go ahead and purchase it direct but I mean I got nothing to say about it man it, it does what it's supposed to do no fancy thing no nothing like that everything works the way that it should and it's just it's been reliable for me so if you do end up purchasing it I, um, I promise you that you're really going to enjoy it. The only thing that it doesn't have, like I said, is the, it's the divide and conquer lift of the entire thing. If you don't really have a use for it, it's not going to be a problem. I don't have a use for it. So it's been like that for the past two years. And I can't think of one instance where I just want to get everything out of the way with everything. But again, guys, be sure to go ahead and like, subscribe. See you in the next one. Later, guys.